Finally, responsive layouts are in bubble and this is all done with a Chrome extension. People who design for bubble know that it's not very easy to design responsive layouts. You need to put groups within groups in a certain way so that they can act responsibly. It's a very tedious process. Welcome to Motion Product. My name is Michael. In today's video, we're going to take a look at creating a structure for a responsive landing page in Bubble using a Chrome extension called Frames. Frames is a Chrome extension created by the team at BuildCamp. And at the moment of the recording, this is a free service. First, we're going to install the Chrome extension. Once that's installed, you'll need to refresh your Bubble Editor screen and you should see this yellow circle button at the bottom right hand corner. Click on that and you'll see different pre-built templates that you can use in your page. Now, I'm going to pick a header. I can click on the header and I can preview each one right here in this small window. You can click on the different size icons and resize the preview to get a feel of how each frame will look responsibly. When it's inserted into, all you need to do is click, copy, and then you paste it into view. What's inserted into bubble are actual bubble elements, so you can customize them to best fit your needs. Here, I wanted the images to alternate left and right, so I just moved the groups inside the frame. Since this extension is only a few days old, I didn't expect it to, ha uh, to have this feature yet, but it will be really nice to have a feature to toggle which side you want uh, certain layouts to be in. And now, the final product. There's going to be a header, a hero, something to talk about the problem, details of that problem, the solution, a belly prop, maybe a second belly prop, a testimonials, solution details, pricing, social proof, and a sign up for a sign up area, and about the instructor uh, section, and a footer to end off the whole page. All that was done in less than 30 minutes. If you had me doing that using the traditional methods, it would have taken me hours, if not days, to do the same thing. This extension has helped me tremendously designing and placing layouts in Bubble, and hopefully it will help you in your process as well. How has this extension helped you with your responsive design? And are there other layouts out there that you're still struggling with? within Bubble. Please leave a comment below. Thank you for checking out this video and here are some of my other videos to help you build better products using no-code tools.